What's up, Wildfire? It's Coach Damien here. We're starting off with an animal-tastic warm-up, all right, before I tell you what's going on for the rest of the day, all right? We have two rounds for quality, right? We're starting off with five bear crawls at five meters. So basically the end of your box or about five to ten walks, right? We're going in, nice, controlled, for five, rotate, two, and so on. Once you finish those five, you got five crab walks. All right, now we're leading from here. Palms face your heels, butt up, right through. You could go this way, and then five this way. Right? Next animal on your list is a seal walk. Working on this core and shoulder engagement. You have one of these. If you're at home, you could use a towel on the tile. Right? Getting everything core nice and engaged from here, right through. Turn around. Woo, woo. And back. <laughs> Your core will love you for this one. All right? Once you finish those five to get nice and warmed up for your handstands, we have five donkey kicks. So keep those arms nice and out, right up. That's a mule kick. Donkey kick is here, like so. All right, you got five of those right up. All right, then you have 10 dead bugs going to the insect world, keeping everything nice and engaged, core, nice and out. One, two, three, four, for 10. All right, once you finish that, you turned into a caterpillar, and now we're on the bar hanging for a 30 second cocoon. Right, look at that. Have fun with this warm-up. You got two rounds for quality, so hopefully you come out as a beautiful butterfly. All right. Now, for your strength slash gymnastics work today, we're doing 10 minutes of handstand walk practice. That's where the seal walk helps you focus on hand movement and engagement, okay? If we want to work on handstand holds and stuff like that and work up to it, we can. Start off in that nice frog tri tripod, right? Build the stability here. Set your head down. Get up. Bring those feet. Then push up, all right? Definitely challenging, focusing on that. You can do wall walks, right? Focusing on that arm stability from here up. Getting comfortable with being upside down and moving your hands. All right, the next thing is, when you're on the wall, you can kick up, take one foot off, tap feet, and get comfortable with being in a free handstand, okay? Next way for this 10 minutes, you go up to the wall walk, or you could accelerate it, right? Get up close, get into here, right? Bring that foot off. Right? Find where you get comfortable and start walking away. There's that way. Final way is walking into the wall. Find a distance where you're not going to collapse, right? And keeping everything nice and engaged. Start from here. You find that wall. Boom. Cool? You get comfortable with that. Then just fr try it out in the distance here, out. Right through. Cool. There's some progressions. If you have a partner, partner can hold a PVC pipe as you kick up and start to walk. All right. Now for your wad for today. Those handstand walks can get you nice and warmed up. We have a 20-minute AMRAP with a buy-in. Okay. We have 800-meter run or four minutes of cardio. Okay. Once you finish that 800 meter, you're coming in. In the remaining time, you have 15 pull-ups, okay? Most likely going kipping or after you turn from a cocoon into a butterfly, all right? Then you have 10 air squats right down. Then 15 handstand push-ups. Be strategical about this because this is going to get your load capacity, all right? Kick up to the wall. Find a way, your modification, if doing 15 kipping is going to be too much, 
add an ab mat so you still get that rep scheme in, but shorter distance or cut those reps down. Then you have 10 alternating pistols. So we're gonna stand, shift our weight over to where our center is on this right foot, right down and up, shift over, down and up. Scaling, you can bring that foot behind, right, and through. If you have a box, do single leg step ups or start working that distance by bringing that foot out. Cool. If you don't have equipment and you have dumbbells, you can do 15 bent over rows like so, or 15 push-ups, body weight, okay? Have fun with this workout. It's a burner, but it's your body. So next time, see you then.